A lot of the junior youth and youth in Linda Vista come from like immigrant families. And part of that is also this kind of hope that they'll find something better here in, in America. Growing up with the family I did and with that atmosphere, I've been able to like not only recognize how I can contribute it, but how I can extend even this like loving character or this perseverance to the community and how like it's it's driven me to like try to talk to others, to invite others, to, to really be um, like open and just kind. I know that when I'm home, I try to like have like talk kindly to like my sister and my mom and like with respect to my mom because she's my mom and um, I know sometimes like there's certain things that like I don't know people like that they say or, or that uh, certain attitudes they take and I, I, I see that I kind of like recognize how like that maybe isn't isn't right or how how it affects my the rest of my family but it helps me realize that like this is something I should also try not to do. It helps me think about like how okay yeah I should be kind but I also shouldn't like do like certain like sh I shouldn't get angry or I shouldn't like do this or that. Right now my service to the community is far different than um, what it was in middle school. Yeah. Now it's a lot more of uh, thinking about generations younger than me and thinking about how best I could serve them so that they can have a future that's a lot better and brighter than the one we have today. I think it's really important for a community to have such like, like family dynamics and it helps motivate and empower the youth not to like I go and out and get money. That's very like short term and not very lasting but to actually contribute something that will will generate joy and happiness and unity in the community for, for generations to come. And having the family that I did, it's helped me and empowered me to do that. So being involved in this type of service, I've really grown a lot in terms of like my ability to communicate with other people because before I was really quite shy <laughs> um, but now I'm more open and expressive um, but I think more importantly I've grown like my ability and capacity to love others I think my family has always tried to lead me down like a good and right path and showed me like these are the good things to do and these are the bad things to do and uh, don't do these but try to do these and it's always kind of abstract but when I found like a way to actually do service and to contribute like it made a bunch more sense and I was able to to recognize that like this is something that's good this is something that will help and, and not be destructive or, or violent so growing up in, in this atmosphere um, and, and with these like qualities and, and experiences like it's also helped me extend it to like this idea of like growing it to community level because we have like I have friends in the community or, or people that I don't even know but like we're all still living in the same place we're all still concerned and part of that also like helps me think of like how as a community we can persevere like bad times if if we do have a more like loving relationship, if we know each other. And even when there aren't bad times, we can even like come together and build something that's, that's better and that's like more vibrant and cohesive.